like me and my buddy Alex are going to show you how to build a computer from scratch. You don't need to know anything, you just got to watch this video. So today we're going to show you how to build a computer using just the parts that you have. I'm Alex. Your screwdriver, uh, your regular just pliers, and your vinegar. The first thing you're going to want to do is open your motherboard box. You should have ordered a motherboard online. You're gonna to want to get your mother, take your motherboard out of the packaging, motherboard, inspect it for any errors. If you see any errors, you're gonna to want to send it back before you put it into your computer. This is my computer box. This is one I've used before. Be easy. Just find a computer box that you've used. You should be able to build your own computer in no time. I ordered an aftermarket cooling fan. This is completely optional. You're gonna need some kind of fan. But for this one, you want to take it out of the packaging. Inspect it, obviously. You're going to want to pour your vinegar directly onto the fan. Make sure you get a good amount on there. It's directly onto there. This is cleaning the fan off so it doesn't let any bad air onto your computer. Blow it on in a little bit. You should be ready to insert it into your computer. Take your motherboard that you just got out of the packaging and you carefully place it inside of the computer box. Take it. The power wire, um, plug it into here, goes in there. Uh, what we did is the uh, 138D series, and what we can do is we can test the... Make uh, sure you have a Phillips head. If you don't have a Phillips head, you won't be able to take apart half the stuff on the computer. Again, if you don't have a regular set of pliers, a small one like these, you might not be able to take apart certain things on the computer. It's very important that you have these. It's also very important that you have your vinegar. If you don't have your vinegar, you might not be able to clean off certain things on the CPU. This is your power ribbon. This has all of the electronic information on it. Insert it in there. That's how you set up your motherboard. It's time to put on the cover and load it. Watch this baby. The cover should slide on easy. Push it right into place. And there's some screws on the back that we're going to insert right now. Tug the BIOS board. You can grab your AVG cables. That's an easy way to build a PC for a beginner, for someone who doesn't really know. If anything that we were teaching Alex you and I confused, all you gotta do is look it up online. Quick Google search since we were kids. Find what you're looking for. Use Internet Explorer. I hope 